As you may know, Apple recently unveils the iPhone 13 lineup during its September 2021 event. I'm sure a lot of Android users will be switching to the iPhone 13, 13 Pro, or the iPhone 13 Pro Max. The iPhone 12 and iPhone 11 series models also got a lot cheaper, so some Android users going to buy them as well. So in this video, I will discuss about three different methods, including the official method, to transfer WhatsApp messages from Android to new iPhone 13, 13 Pro, or iPhone 13 Pro Max. These instructions will work fine with other iPhone models too. Without further ado, let's get started. In the first method, I will use WhatsApp transfer tool by iPhone to PC to transfer WhatsApp messages from Android to my iPhone 13 Pro Max. After running the app on Windows or Mac, select the WhatsApp or WhatsApp business transfer feature as per your need. Now you will need to select the backup mode and connect your old Android phone to your PC with the USB cable. As soon as you click the Backup Now button, the tool will remind you to enable USB debugging mode on Android. So, let's do that. In order to allow the USB debugging, you need to first unhide the Developer Options menu by going to Settings, About Phone and tapping on Build Number 7 times. After unhiding the Developer Options menu, go to this Developer Options menu and enable the USB debugging mode from there. Now the tool is asking me to back up all the WhatsApp chats to the local storage on my Android. In order to back up WhatsApp chats to local storage on your Android, go to Settings, Chats, Chat Backup and tap the Backup button. Before tapping the Backup button, make sure that Never is selected under the Backup to Google Drive section. Now click the Continue button and the software will start backing up your WhatsApp messages on your computer. Finally, the tool will ask you to verify your phone number that is associated with your WhatsApp account. App asks you to do that so that it can keep your WhatsApp data secure by verifying your ownership. Now enter your six-digit verification code and click the Verify button. You will be logged out from your WhatsApp account on Android. After the phone verification, your WhatsApp messages and media files will be successfully transferred from your Android to your computer. You can now disconnect your Android device from your computer. Now I will restore the WhatsApp messages from Android WhatsApp Backup to my iPhone 13 by using the Restore to iOS feature. To do that, I will connect my iPhone 13 to my computer and click the Restore Now button. Now I have to log into my WhatsApp account on iPhone by verifying my phone number. If you want, you can now remove the SIM card from Android and put it in your iPhone. Now I will log into my WhatsApp account that I was using on my Android by verifying my phone number. You can skip this step if you are already logged into your WhatsApp account. After logging into your WhatsApp account, click the Logged In button. Now you are required to turn off the Find My iPhone feature on your iPhone. You can re-enable it after transferring WhatsApp chats from Android to your iPhone 13, 13 Pro or 13 Pro Max. You will also need to go to Settings and tap on your Apple profile to find the option to disable the Find My iPhone feature on your iPhone. Music 
After disabling the Find My iPhone feature, click the Try Again button. Software will transfer all the chats and media from the backup to your iPhone 13 or any other iPhone in a few minutes. Currently, this is the easiest and fastest method to transfer WhatsApp chats from Android to iPhone. Now I'll quickly open the WhatsApp on my iPhone 13 Pro Max and show you the WhatsApp chats and media that I successfully transferred from the backup. Everything, including all the media files, got transferred to my iPhone. Now let's move to the next method. Before moving to the next method, let me give you an important update. As per multiple reliable sources like Android Police and WhatsApp Beta Info, WhatsApp is working on a feature that will help you transfer your WhatsApp chat history from Android to any iPhone, and that includes the iPhone 13 as well. The details on how this feature will work are still unknown, but you'll likely need to connect your Android and iPhone via a USB-C to Lightning Cable and use the Move to iOS app. This feature is still under development and it will be available in a future update, probably by January 2022. Let's jump to the next method. In this method, I will basically tell you how you can use the export chat feature to forward your WhatsApp chats and media files to your own email address and then download them on your iPhone. For exporting a particular WhatsApp conversation, you need to open it on your phone. Next, go to settings, tap more to open the chat menu. From the chat, select the export chat option. You'll get an option to export your chats with or without the media content. Select any email app to forward these WhatsApp chats and media files to your email address. Now, I will open that email that has my WhatsApp chats and media files. From here, you can download the WhatsApp media files and the text file that has your chats on your iPhone. This method is only suitable if you just want to keep just few old WhatsApp conversations on your iPhone for future reference. So these are the few methods to transfer WhatsApp chats from Android to iPhone, including the iPhone 13. That's it for now. Thanks so much for watching.